Albuquerque has never had an African-American mayor, but one of the three candidates trying to earn your vote says history would be made if voters elected him to office. Eddie Edegon says if you vote for him, you'd be electing the city's first African-American mayor. I'm simply talking about my background, my diversity, Hispanic, uh, certainly Native American, uh, black, and we have a great history here uh, in the city of Albuquerque. And I think I'm a good reflection of the cross-section of the populations that live here in Albuquerque. Edegon, who's a radio talk show host, posted this on his station's website and on his Facebook page, asking people to elect Albuquerque's first black mayor and to make Albuquerque great again. So if you're elected, would you consider yourself the first African-American mayor in Albuquerque? Um, it's part of my history. I don't know. It depends upon whether the community would consider me that. Edegon says he did a DNA test that determined that he is 4.6 percent black and that is double the percentage of black people in Albuquerque. That comes directly off of uh, an ancestry test uh, in terms of you've done that where you've swabbed and sent it in and you get it back and it tells you what percentages you are. He also says there are not enough African Americans who work for the city and if he's elected he would change that. The city of Albuquerque black population is 3.2 percent you know uh, only 1.7 percent of all city employees are black. The city election is November 2nd.